family want to ride. I'm not a motocross guy, I don't like pretend metal for frat boys, and I don't drink Mountain Dew. I couldn't be further from this game's intended audience, yet even I had to stop and marvel at this thing. It's far from perfect, but for its very specific audience, Freak Style is a pretty impressive game. Released in 2002 for the PlayStation 2 and GameCube, Freak Style is basically SSX with less snow and tires and the worst soundtrack ever. Anyway, it's about driving a bike really fast, and doing lots of crazy tricks, bashing your face against the table, because this game's ridiculously fucking hard. Yo, I guess sometimes maybe I'm coming from a different place when I look at a game's controls, because to me, the freak style is way too slidey and drifty. I, I absolutely hated this game's controls. But to me, a game like Mario Kart has tight racing control. You know, you, you mostly stick to the track, unless you're in the ice levels. This is like all ice levels. I had a hell of a time staying on two wheels, let alone alive. Poor, poor Leanne Tweed. But again, uh, my personal complaint aside, I seem to be one of the only people who feel that way about this game. And maybe it's a product of, you know, in 2002, this game's controls were probably par for the course. Because a, a decade of evolution in control and game design can go a long way. Or hey, but maybe it's just not my type of game. You know, probably a mixture of both. On the topic of aging, though, uh, this game looks pretty terrible. I, and I don't mean from a technical perspective, it's actually very impressive for the PS2, especially in terms of its speed and frame rate. But the style and the colors, ugh, terrible. Look, looks like the color brown ate a crayon salad of only brown crayons, and then, then got its stomach pumped. This is what was in its stomach. Player one, back of the pack. No hander. So it's kind of ugly, the music's obnoxious, and I hate the controls. So why do I say it's an impressive game? Well, because I mean, if you can get past all that, there's actually a pretty cool racer here. Pretty brutal racer. The learning curve is steep, sense of speed is fantastic, and it has actual racer guys. So again, if you're into motocross and don't mind a challenge, freak style is absolutely worth a look. Just make sure you wear a helmet. No, in real life. For, for when you smash your head through things. Safety first! I'll wear this later. Will this work for you?